hey dear welcome to you in my youtube channel in this tutorials i am going to show you how to display different image in mobile and desktop device on your shopify online store so this tutorial will be very helpful if you have started your online business with shopify and wanted to make your website more user friendly more responsive and more SEO friendly then you can continue this video here i am going to share the easy video guideline with code snippet that you can use in your shopify online store so let's get started so here is my shopify online store and i wanted to use different images in mobile version right now i am visiting this website from my desktop and i wanted to check it from mobile looks here i wanted to this will be a different image and there have a option so that i can dynamically change this image from the theme customization section so let me open my another folder to show you the real example so you can see that i have two images this one for desktop slider and this image size 150 kb for desktop and its width 1050 pixel and height 1000 and and in b side i have created another image for mobile slider and this image size is 34 kb and its width 450 pixel and height 588 pixel so the main things is that you can follow here the image file size this one for desktop and its size 150 kb and this one for mobile and its size only 34 kb so here is the most important reason why we have to use different images for desktop and mobile you may know that most of the user of shopify website come from mobile you can expect a lot of order from your mobile user customers okay now go back my shopify admin panel and we will start our step by step process right now here is my shopify admin panel and i'm going to click on the customize section and open the customize section in another tab that's why i'm going to click on it also keeping pass on my keyboard control so that it open on another tab in the same way i'm going to open code editor so here is the customize section and you can see that we have used the image banner section here and we wanted a different image upload option right here for mobile version or mobile device okay to do this i'm going to my code editor section and open image folder dot liquid file and now scroll down and copy this settings paste it here and make it mobile image and click on the save okay now going to my customization section and reload this space and we can see that there are uh, option for us to upload image for mobile so just going to reload this page well we can see that they are have an option name mobile image now we can upload the image just upload this one save change but we have not done yet we have to do a little bit more things for display the image dynamically on our website when we visit in mobile version also we have to hide this first image or desktop image from the mobile version so to do this i'm going to back my code editor and now here i'm going to do another things just duplicate this code and and in the section settings image just put mobile image okay section settings mobile image okay section settings mobile image all right and now we have to add new class right here 
I have already added this class code on my blog site e-commerce thesis so I'm going to my OS site in e-commerce thesis I'll share this code link in the video description looks here so here is the CSS code just copy this class go back code edit section and add this class right here and again copy this class add this class right here and now we have to add the CSS code in image banner liquid section Let's go back okay and click on the save and go back my customizer section and we have already added different image for desktop and mobile now going to reload my website and check it by inspect you can see there is a desktop image and now I'm going to check it by mobile so click on the Trugal device toolbar just click on it wow you can see that there is a different image for mobile device so I hope you understand the easy process you can get uh, the code snippet in my blog site e-commerce thesis so thank you for your time to watch this video if you think this video is helpful then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel and if you need any service support relevant shopify wordpress or marketing then you can contact with me have a nice day bye bye